got a question. You have to analyze the question properly. Normally what we do is, we'll just find the answer and go to the next question. That is the wrong approach. The right approach is, you should know why this is the answer. If this is the answer, why this is the answer? And why the other options are not the answers? When they will become the answer? How they will become the answer? This is called as question analysis. See, it is a competitive exam, PG entrance exam. And you have to be more competitive and you have to really work on a strategy. This is one strategy which I'm talking about. You should know. You should dissect the question as much as possible. See, to learn, we have to keep asking ourselves questions. Why is this the answer? Why the others are not the answer? When they will become the answer? How they will become the answer? These questions, if we keep asking to ourselves, then uh, our learning is better, memory is better, recall is better, exam is better, rank is better, course is better, place is better. You want a good PG seat in a good PG college. It all begins with asking questions to yourself. And examinations are going to take a lot of efforts from us. That hard work must be put in a particular direction. There must be a strategy. See, competitive exams are strategic exams. You must have the strategy. Then only you'll develop the confidence to enter the exam hall. And that should not be overconfidence. That should not be underconfidence. That should be pure confidence. And that pure confidence comes only when you had a sound strategy and you're working hard on that. So what is that strategy we are talking about? The approach towards any exam, maybe PG entrance exam or any exam is universal. What is that universal approach? More than 70% of the questions are repeat topics. Why is that? So, because it's simple. How many years have you spent on MBBS? Five years, five and a half years? So, is it possible to ask all the five and a half year knowledge in three and a half hours, three hours, two and a half hours? Exam time is only that much. It's not possible. Examiner knows that. That's why he will select some topics. Human brain can remember certain amount of facts at a particular moment of time. It's important to know. That's why previous year questions are important, especially the last 15 years. If you go through them, you will come to know the latest pattern. You'll find some hot topics. You build upon those hot topics and you score more than 70%. And if you score more than 70% in any exams, maybe All India PG, AIMS or PG at Chandigarh, PG at Jipmar, Nimhans or DNB, if you are scoring more than 70%, then you are in the top 10 of any exam. That's what you want, actually, isn't it? Top 10 in any exam. So, the point is, you have to know everything about few topics, and you have to know few things about every topic. This is what I will do throughout the session, the anatomy session. But it is not only applicable to anatomy, it is applicable to any subject, maybe physiology, biochemistry, paraclinical, clinical, whichever. You have to focus and you have to defocus. I'll take a short story regarding this focus defocus. If you have heard, Dronacharya is asking Pandavas to hit the eye of the bird and uh, calls them one after the other. Nakul comes and the Dronacharya is asking Nakul, Nakul, you have to hit the eye of the bird. But before you shoot the arrow, I have to ask a question to you and answer it. Then only you can shoot. So Nakul comes and he is aiming. Dronacharya asks him the question. What do you see? Nakul is telling what I see is a bird. What else do you see? I see the tree. What else? I see the hut there with the door. There I sleep in the night. And Dronacharya says, no, you go away, please. The next one comes. Sadev, you register. Lastly, he will call Arjun. He's asking Arjun. Arjun, aim and hit the eye of the bird. And I'll ask you a question before you hit. So Arjun is aiming. Dronacharya is asking, Arjun, what do you see? Arjun replies back, nothing. Again, he's asking, Arjun, what do you see? And Arjun replies back, I see the retina of the eye of the bird. Is it possible to see the retina of the eye of the bird from this distance? No, but he's seeing that. This is called focus. And what is defocus? Dronachal is asking, can you see the bird? No. Can you see the tree? No. Can you see your brothers? No. Can you see me? You. Who are you? I don't know. I just know the retina of the eye of the bird. This is called focus and defocus. This is what you have to learn. Importance of previous year questions cannot be understated or overstated. They are very important. Actually, our brain works like a computer or you can say the computer works like our brain. We have a hard drive and we have a RAM. What is RAM? Random access memory. When you are in your MBBS, the final half years, 
you are using your RAM to attempt the questions in your exams, but five and a half years, the knowledge is actually going into your hard drive. So hard drive is very slow. You cannot use hard drive in the exam. In the exam, what you use is random access memory, which is most often accessed and quick to use. How do you build your RAM so that it can help you in your exams? You have to continuously fill it up with useful information. And how do you know what is useful, what is not? By practicing those previous year questions.